Hello everyone, Drew Wilson of Your Era Gamer here. Today we're going to be taking a trip back to the year of 2007. This is when the Steam game Penumbra Overture was released. It's one of only two games in the series, I believe. <laughs> but anyway, I've got two minutes on the clock. Let's check this one out. And this is a game that I know very little, and I mean very little about. Um, as far as I know, it is a survival horror game, but or so. But my marks don't change much in Greenland, so I got a pretty decent idea of where I'm heading. Okay. Yeah, I don't know much about this, but let's keep empty. So it's just once I found it, double clicking the left mouse. Inventory tab. Oh, wow. Okay, so we have to actually grab things. Uh, torch runs out of batteries. Um, for those who are a little bit less familiar with the uh, linguistics of uh, British versus North American, torch is the same thing as a actual flashlight. This is a mandatory. Extra batteries. Cool. All right, so we got a glow stick actually. Okay. Uh, to do list. I'm assuming that's going to be my um, quest. I'm super brave in the weather until I have to. All right, so I'm presuming we're passing the time. So I find this actually very interesting that you have to actually click and drag to lift things. So let's move you. Here. <laughs> Interesting design. All right. Uh huh. Well, you can grab that at least, which is odd in a way. Well, you can't grab your coat, though. And yet, somehow I'm not allowed outside, which limits my options here. I can't right click on that. Well, we're off to a fantastic start. Ah. Uh, so there must be something in here. Ok, 
Okay, flashlight, F for flashlight, G for glow stick. Well, I'd be let out. No. Okay. Notebook. Okay, that's something else. All right, now we can go. <laughs> My understanding is this is supposed to be a bit more of a puzzler type of game anyway, so I guess that makes sense. We're trying to figure things out. Need shelter soon. All right. Let's get moving. So, chances are we'll need that. All right. Cool. <laughs> All right. Well, this is interesting. Open. All right. <laughs> Take that. There we go. Finally. <laughs> I appreciate the um, using the mouse to kind of move things as a kind of a different kind of interactivity, but when it's a little bit, f little bit finicky, uh, might be more, you know, blocky and well, not blocky, but uh, I don't know what the term is. I'm sure there's a good term for that. So you fell from that, okay. Can't lift it. Interesting. All right, let's try G for glow stick for now. Empty ammunition crates. Whatever that is, a flare. Cool. Stuck must be something in the way. All right. Got another flare. Hammer. Not much else in here. But it doesn't hurt to be thorough because sometimes these games hides things pretty darn well. Alright, tab. Do we equip it? With one, probably. Alright, so... G one G one That's my bare hands, but all 
Alright. Let's try the other side. One. I'm thinking of blowing that up. <laughs> okay, let's try this then. Very well. Ah, all right. So, uh, not exactly the strongest start to a game, but we did make a little bit of distance. So. Yeah, interesting. <laughs> that looks a little bored. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Anyway, um, that's it for time on that one. And uh, I'm sure uh, moving forward on the game, I mean, for those who've played that game, it's like, oh, the solutions are so obvious. What were you what do you think? Well, I have not, I've never played this game before, so I'm just, I'm still getting used to the controls and trying to figure out what I need to do. But, uh, yeah, it took me, I know it took, probably took a little bit longer than I sh it should have, but I, it is what it is. So, um, enough about, um, my thoughts on this. I actually kind of curious what you thought of all this, um, was, uh, when you, if you, for those of you who have played this, uh, what did you think of this? Was this a really interesting game, like a different style of puzzle game that uh, was really interesting to you, or were you thinking this is, you know, not the greatest game in the wor in the world, and just another maybe dime a dozen style game? Yeah, let us know in the comments below on that one. But for those of you who have not played this game. Um, what did you think of, of this, uh, this game? Was it, and, and I know there was like another game in this series too. So if you've played the other game and now seeing this one, does this look like an interesting game to you? Or do you think, well, there's probably other games that are probably a little bit more interesting to you. Well, let us know in the comments below on that one. And for those of you who haven't played this at all, um, what do you think of what you saw? Does it look like, um, kind of an interesting one? Was it, oh, you could probably do better at solving these things than me and, uh, want to, give this a go or maybe you're looking at this and thinking yeah I'm not so sure about this one if I would really be into it so yeah let us know in the comments below uh, what your thoughts are on that so uh, yeah I guess that is all for now and until next time what's your era